For those of you who don't know, Shovel Knight Treasure Trove is getting even more free DLC, some of which is clearly an apology for Shovel Knight not being playable in Smash. Which is unnecessary, because the independently developed, Kickstarter funded, 8-bit retro aesthetic 2D platformer Shovel Knight has nothing to apologize for, besides having the same origin story as every other hit indie game. Although it is important to say it did set the precedent, mostly because Shovel Knight is so good that it's off-putting. The characters are unique, the story is charming, the tunes are catchy, and the artwork is picturesque. But what sets Shovel Knight apart is the objectively good level design. No part of this game feels even remotely repetitive, even when revisiting the same levels with Plague Knight and Spectre Knight. Shovel Knight excels at letting players learn and grow at their own pace, and then challenge themselves accordingly. At the end of the day, the fact that this game from 2014 has remained popular and continues to get DLC even now is both a testament to Yacht Club's game design preeminence and a stinging reminder that Shovel Knight will never be in Smash. Probably.